All right, let's get to the radio graffiti calls here. All right, put the well. well no, no, no. Can we connect to the radio graffiti line engineer, please? All right, let's, let's connect it. You're about to hear troll hell, by the way. All right. There are nine participants in the conference. All right, uh, shut up! Anyway, once again, man, you want to call the Radio Graffiti? The number is on top of the chat box on the screen. You dial the number, you push in the code when the bitch uh, starts talking, and uh, ba -da -ba -da -ba -ba, you're in queue. All right, let's go ahead and take some fucking numbers here. Uh, how about 520 Radio Graffiti? Hey, buddy, this is here, the dog, man. Uh, well, look who it is, this fucking guy. What is your what, what what is your excuse? What's my excuse for what, man? Excuse for living! What is your problem? What do you mean? What, what, what? No, I don't have a problem, man. What's your problem? Dude, you have been fucking crawling up my asshole trying to fucking take a whiff of my hemorrhoids. What is your fucking problem? Oh, you've got hemorrhoids, huh? Well, that's... That sounds like a problem to me, dude. Yeah, you yeah, here. Here, you know what? Why don't you just stay there? I'm going to pop one right in your fucking mouth, you fucking piece of shit. Say ah. Are you ready? Here. Here. Oh, here, here, here. here uh, take it. You like that? I'm sure you love that shit, huh? Give me a drink. Uh, you get off on that, dude? You get off on that? Well, it sounds like you're getting off. You're like, oh, uh, you get off of the guy? I actually like boils and being popped all over my fucking private parts is what you just fucking sounded like with your fruity-ass fucking epileptic voice. Oh, that's me laughing, dude. You sound fucking ridiculous. Yeah, I sound like you're ridiculous. I mean, why don't you, why don't you, why don't you come say... On, come on, Come on, what? All you've said is sentence fragments, you epileptic fuck. Why don't you say something? Well, because you won't let me talk. You well, then talk! Idiot. Talk, you fruity, lazy tongue piece of shit! Talk! You want me to talk? I want to know what your fucking problem is. You block me on the fucking Vaughn immediately when I start talking? I don't even fucking talk that much, dude. You still upset about the black ding-dong? It's not even a fucking ding-dong. It's a fucking dildo, dude. Yeah. Yes, I'm still fucking... Yeah, yeah. I, I, I don't... I don't... I, still I, I don't head. like... I don't like head. fucking... Like you... Tried to go and say, hey, look, there's nothing wrong with a black dildo being used in a meme because I'm a fucking homosexual. I'm fucking tired of that, you lazy tongue fucking epileptic piece of shit. Do you understand that? That's why I don't like you. You're effeminate. You're a tard. You're epileptic. I'm probably paid for you, and you make me sick. Do you understand that? There. Is that a oh, fucking oh, answer for guy. you? Poor little guy. Do you look under the bed for me before you... Yeah, stay. that's what Are I thought. Okay? I, 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 shut up with your fucking neat bucks, all right? Let me tell you something. If Donald Trump if wanted to be fucking... If he wanted to do something crazy that would help this country, he would put people like you into a fucking separate area from the country, all right? All you fucking autists that are out here, I, yeah, I'm autistic, I, I'm retarded, I can't fucking work. You should all be put in a fucking, like an area of the country of your own, all right? I'm not fucking... I'm, I'm tired of this stupid fucking autistic... Hey, look, I'm just a Todd. I, I, I'm epileptic. I, 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 I'm a Todd. Oh, God, dude. Oh, my God. You know, I need another fucking beer. You know, I mean, Jesus fucking Christ. Hey, look, all these people are going... Hey, look, Herod Todd didn't do nothing. He's a good Todd. <laughs> fucking good Todd. A good fucking Todd. This guy can't do shit. He's, I'm, my taxpaying dollars are fucking supporting this piece of shit. All right? I don't like that shit. Anyway, I think everybody out there knows what time it is. All right? It's time for more beer. <laughs> fucking autistic motherfuckers, man. And by the way, everybody that's in all my chat rooms... I tell them that if they're autistic or they were diagnosed with Asperger's or some shit, I tell them, 
Okay, that's great. You know how to get rid of it? Don't acknowledge it ever again! Every time you meet an Asperger or autistic fuck, the first thing that comes out of their fucking suck hole, I'm autistic, I'm retarded. I got this, I got that. I can't fucking stand that shit. All right? So listen, if you just don't talk about it, you just pretend you don't have it, watch how different people are going to fucking react to your stupid, dumb, fucking tarred ass. All right? God, fucking goddamn tards of this country, man. And then you wonder why I have no problem bringing in a bunch of fucking Mexicans into this country so they can do my lawn. All right? They're courteous. You could pay a Mexican like $4 an hour and they'll work on the lawn all fucking day, dude. My fucking goddamn... My curb appeal has never looked better. But no, I if I hired these fucking pricks, I'm not joking around. I tried to hire American. I'm not kidding. I swear to God, I talked to the fucking inner circle about this. I tried to hire American. And this fucker's like, oh, I can do it, but that I need 30 bucks an hour. 30 bucks an hour. So I talked to this prick and I was like, all right, well. I mean, do you know about fuck? You, you know about plants? Do you know about like fucking soil? Do you know how you know fertilization? Like all the all the fucking shit. I, I was like, yeah, I know all that shit. So I was like, okay, I'll, I'll, I'll hire you for thirty bucks an hour, but I want to make sure that you know my shit looks like the best, right? So right when I said that I would hire him, this fucking guy, like, tried to give me some kind of a contract of like, well. Can you give me a work responsibilities contract or some, some shit where he wanted me to define every single fucking shit that I was... Uh, dude, I'm paying you 30 bucks an hour, you fucking useless fucking lawn vagrant. All right? I'm paying you 30 fucking bucks an hour. All right? You should fucking know what it takes to fucking uh, do lawn shit and gardening. This fucking guy, like, look, I want you to give me a well-defined what I'm supposed to do. Jesus fucking... Dude, the American public sucks. As a matter of fact, I wrote a song about this shit. All right? Let me play that shit. I gotta, I gotta fucking drain the main vein anyway. All right? I gotta drain the main vein anyway. Let me fucking... Where the, I, I, thought, I wrote a couple of them. I forgot which one was the best, but... All right, let's get back to rating graffiti. I just, I needed to take a break to, to drain the main vein, all right? All right, how about, uh, we're, we're going back to rating graffiti. How about 561, rating graffiti? Hi, Ghost. It's your biggest anime fan here. Okay, what's up? <laughs> and by the way, I'm the one who sent you donuts of ReZero clips, by the way. Go by Choppa Man. Oh, uh, yeah? Well, now you're starting to sound... Oh. Now you're starting to say, you sound a little effeminate, and now you're starting to sound like a little fat femme. So what is it? You're effeminate or you're a fat femme? A black hooded badass, of course. You're a black hooded badass? What are you, so are you like gothic? Oh, yes. Alex Mercer style gothic, if you know what I mean. Oh, uh, yeah, so. Imagine that having that level kind of, uh, imagine having that kind of power level when going into anime realms. So, are you, so are, are you like one of those goth, like, emo femboys? <laughs> Super powered ones, just to correct you. I wrote a chat GPT fanfic of what will happen if you ended up in the Reefier anime world, if you want to know. Yeah, right. You know what? That's why you reverted to your fanfic, because you wish, <laughs> you I wish you were. And look, there's Pete Headseth. We'll get to it right after Radio Graffiti or whenever these people piss me off. But you wish you were a goth boy and a man, enemy femboy, dude. You see, I understand how to get psychological with these people. You understand? Uh -uh. I get deep with these people. Uh, let's see. Let's continue. How about 719 Radio Graffiti? Hey, what up, ghost? How's it going, man? Uh, it's going pretty good. It's Mongon here. How you doing? Hey, it's Mongon. What's up, dude? Nothing much, brother. Uh, I was drinking earlier. I drank the whole thing. I was watching that, uh, that Tyson fight, but really I was watching the two fights before it. I forgot it was, like, some girl fighting another fight. Those were really good. Really, I, really I good. heard they were kind of meh, you know? 
Yeah. Yeah, they were meh. Especially the last one. Mike Tyson was versus Jake Paul was a... I, I told match. everybody that that's the way it was going to be, man. It, it, that's not a legit boxing that's match. I thought it was going to be, too. It was a joke. Yeah, like Mike Tyson's... I mean, he's Mike Tyson, but he was fucking old. And Jake Paul's young, and he's been training like hell. It was just the writing was all over the wall. It was ridiculous, man. You want to give a shout out to anybody, man? Uh, all right. I was gonna get my usual shout. Wait, hold up, hold up, hold up. I want to take a toke at the back of here before before I. Get all to right, go. man. Hurry up, man. I'm gonna take a drink while you're doing that. All right. <sighs> all right, man. You He's smoking. He's, he's inhaling now. I hope it's uh, I hope it's flour and not wax. I think people who do wax, you might as well, you might as well do crack if you're going to do wax. All right, if you want my opinion. <laughs> all right, all right. Uh, shout out to you first of all. This has been a pretty good show. Uh, shout out to Phil. Shout out to Vaporing. Shout out to Syrup. Uh, my boy Time Nerd and uh, shout out to the chats, the Vaughn chat. Uh, I would say shout out to the D Live chat, but now that Jack the Lux raised there, it's ass. All right, that we don't need your fucking opinion about uh, being a critic of the chat rooms. All right, this fucking shit. Five two zero Radio Graffiti. Well, hello again, buddy. Uh, didn't I just call Get this fucking fruit bowl out of here. Take about 10 steps away from my butt crack. 260 Radio Graffiti. Hello? What up? Hey, what up, man? So, uh, this is Phil Harvey. Uh, we got Phil Harvey. That was actually a very interesting little wrestling match that you got. I got to give you props. Yeah, yeah, man. No, it, it took a lot of planning, you know? Like, you got, you got crafty art. That was actually pretty good. I'll, I'll be honest, except for my fucking nephew and the the boyfriend. I, I why the fuck did you throw that in there? Hello. Hold on. Oh. What, what, what the hell? Are you all right? Hello? Are you all right, Phil Harvey? Yeah. yeah, I'm all right. I don't know what that was about. My phone just freaked out. <laughs> anyway, so yeah, it took. Yeah, I don't know what happened back there, you know. I must have got the message. Somehow they wanted me to have a fight between him and his boyfriend. I mean, right. it should happen, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But, all right, you want to give a shout-out? Well, anyway. Right? Yeah, you want to give a shout-out? Good. It was a uh, decent video, all right? But, but you want to give a shout-out? I, I, I got one more thing. I got one more thing, and I'll give a good shout-out. Okay? All right, go ahead. All right. I want you to defend your title against a mystery opponent I will pick. And then, oh, and for um, Jag for running away on his match, I feel like a little pitch. It's going to be Mongon that he's going to get in his neck. But anyway, the shout out will be uh, fuck you here. All right. Well, thank you, Phil Harvey. I appreciate that. All right. Good Lord. All right. Let's take one more. Well, I think we got Haywood. Hey, Haywood. What up, dude? Hey, what's up, man? Do I sound a little bit better now with the new headset? Yeah, actually, it's pretty good. It's come in clearly. Yeah, that's dope. That's dope, dude. Uh, you having a good night today? Uh, it, it, dude, it's been a fucking roller coaster of bullshit. It's a super full beaver moon or something, and you can tell, dude. Ah, you, can, yeah. you, you can tell it's, it, that's what it is. Ah, uh, yeah, dude. It's, it's a fucking beautiful moon tonight. I saw it on the way home tonight. It's been fucking amazing. And apparently, yeah, I don't know, I don't know if you read this, I mean, since we're talking about celestial stuff, <laughs> I, I don't know if you know this, but, um, uh, hold on, wait a minute, Geno X 1987, can you put me in a match beating Ghost with his wheelchair? Fuck off, Geno. Um, <laughs> the, there's a, uh, an asteroid that was in space that NASA like collided with in order to collect I don't know remnants or whatever the fuck and anyway the debris from running into that asteroid is supposed to be like coming into Earth's uh, like like on to Earth here in the next bit. this weekend and I don't know what the hell that's gonna do I don't know if y'all know that ah nah dude that sounds pretty sweet I mean I'm sure we have enough technology to like throw it off orbit to like miss us 
No, dude, you don't yeah, understand. Yeah, no, no, no. Right. It's not the it's not the asteroid. It's like uh, NASA like sent a projectile uh-huh. like into a asteroid that was around our vicinity. And the debris from that, like the crash into that, is now coming Uh-oh. towards Earth. Oh, so it's like Armageddon. We turned a giant ball into a fucking shotgun, like spread. Yeah, it's going to be something like that, like a shotgun. Shot. Yeah, something that's bird yeah. shot, as opposed to yeah. bug shot. Yeah. So that's supposed yeah, to happen yeah, yeah. this weekend on top of the supermoon. I mean, that'll be it. That, that'll make for really good skies. But if we have a super moon, we're going to have so much lunar light that we're probably not going to see it unless we're out in the boonies. I mean, even if you're out in the boonies, you're going to have so much lunar light. That That's a very good point. I know it. a super moon does p- project a lot of light. Yeah, that's, that's what I'm getting at. Like, I, I know you discount a lot of what I say because I drink a lot. But, uh, I know, uh, dude. I mean, look, if it chart. if it makes sense, I, I'm cool with it. But, you know, sometimes you, you're, yeah, you're, know, you're a little know, smashed, know. you know. I know, I know but you, you have to second guess it. You have to think about it like a second time and just, like, you know, reconsider it and everything. Uh, oh, fuck, man. I'd buy that uh, for a dollar. Do you think Netanyahu will uh, fucking last or no? <laughs> I know he's uh, you know getting opposition over there in Israel, and uh, yeah, I, I I don't know. I mean, I, I look. I don't want to get uh, I don't want to get too political, but because Trump is now going to be in power, he's going to give mm-hmm. Netanyahu full reign. As a matter of fact, uh, yeah, I wouldn't be yeah. some. He's going to give him carte blanche, right? Oh, dude, a the full carte blanche. And I'm look. I'm not entirely against that, but Netanyahu is a kind oh, of a loose God. cannon. He's kind of a loose cannon. Well, look. Yes. Uh, well, yes. Uh, well, let me explain. What he's done so far, I think, is like shock and awe the fucking Middle East, which I think is, I, I, I mean, if they were to pull back now, I'm talking to Israel, they would, uh, you know, be like looked at as badasses. But I think that Netanyahu yeah. wants to like continue on. He wants to absolutely continue on, and not just into Iran. I mean, I mean, he wants to. He wants to do the Israeli biblical thing in which they control, like, the area of Euphrates and yeah. and all this bullshit and, and so that their Messiah comes back. And that's really, I think, the motive of uh, of Netanyahu. And that's why there's a lot of yeah. uh, Orthodox Jews that are backing him up. You know that the reason that the defense minister stepped down uh, here about a week or two ago, one of the issues was uh, that... Netanyahu does not want Orthodox I'd Jews. Buy that for a dollar. Uh, thank you, famous Richard. Uh, he doesn't want Orthodox Jews serving in the military. They he wants uh, the exemption, right. and the defense minister said fuck that, and he and he resigned. Anyway, go ahead. Okay, all right. All right. Let me let me lay it down for everybody so everybody knows. Okay, so the amount of decadence that has degraded that society. The amount of money that we have given them, they could have built a Suez Canal 2.0 with the money that we have given them, but instead they decided to take this money from us and spend it on weapons and harboring children for their sex. No, 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 I'm not, I'm not letting you say that. That is an absolute false indictment. And we're not we're not doing that, dude. All right. I mean, for fuck's sake. All right. Let's take some names here. I I, I didn't mean to get this on, uh, you know, any kind of like TCR type of chat, but you know, it is what it is. All right. Let's take some names. How about the? Oh no. Wait. Hold on. Somebody donated. I have to. I have to get them first. Five oh nine. Radio graffiti. Hey, Ghost, this was your cousin, Meat Rock, from New Jersey. I didn't get a call last week because I was busy working slamming hands, which is the family tradition, I might add. Why haven't you been doing that? Well, dude, I, I it's been a fucked up night. So you, you say you slam hams, so you're like, you know, what, what does that mean? That you're banging broads? That means we're just slamming the ham out here because, you know, I, I'm, I'm Meat. But anyway, 
I want to have a talk with you about that wrestling segment, cousin. Now, you know I love you because you're my family. Oh, uh, somehow. But okay. the fact of you being better than JR wrestling commentary would be about as likely as the Longhorns being in against the Sooners. Yeah, no, 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 fuck you, dude. All right, well, first of all, we beat the shit out of the Sooners. And secondly, I, I think I did better commentary on that Phil Harvey match than, than, than any of the goddamn wrestling commentators, if you want my opinion. I mean, I guess the only thing that I was missing is after uh, Ghost would have won, I mean, it, it, it's a fucking JR. So cold! So cold! I mean, that's, I mean, that's about it. I mean, come on, Maine. All right, let's take some names here. Where are we at? Uh, how about the chat room trial, Radio Graffiti? Rocks ass Radio Graffiti. Guys, I swear I did not do it. That I had nothing to do with that. You know what? Blame Jack. He's the one he's known for doing. Whoa, 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 whoa. How, how, how dare you? How d d dare you? How dare you frame me for this ghost? I thought we had an, an, an alliance. And now you're fucking framing me? Who else in this room would have done something so horrible to my poor Pinochet? You took him away from me, Jag. Just admit it already. No, Ghost. You've got it all wrong. If I was really the one who did that to Pinochet, then what's your alibi, Ghost? My alibi? <laughs> I was in the bedroom with Pippa. I wouldn't have had any time to go ahead and kill poor Pinochet over there. You... Were it? I don't really remember that. I mean, you think I would remember that if that actually happened? Silly um, me. <laughs> it did happen, but you may or may not have been awake. Anyway, who cares about my alibi? It was clearly all Jag's fault. Hold on, just one second. Pippa, you don't remember this happening? Do you remember where Ghost actually was? No, actually, the last time I think I saw a ghost, it was when we were in the kitchen together. He gave me some kind of drink. I mean, it tasted pretty good, but I felt really sleepy afterwards. You you, you drugged her, d d didn't you, ghost? You dr dr drugged her so you could get away with the crime of t t t killing Pinochet! No! I would never do something that bad. Ever. I don't know why you're accusing me so hard. I'm not the one who's known as a dog fucker. Uh, oh, yeah? We'll, we'll, we'll see about that. I understand it now. Y you've been the one doing all of this. Everyone had been calling me a zoophile, a dog fucker, a, 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 a monkey, a, a heavy lover, and yet you're the one who's been doing all of this. You have been using me as your fall guy. You want Thawne Chat to redirect their disdain for you to me! Here's exactly how Pinochet was killed and what happened! Y y you invited Pippa to the kitchen to have a drink or two since you two were g g g getting back together. You prepared her drink before she made it to the kitchen. It was carrot juice. Except you laced it! You d d d d drugged her so you could abuse her in the bedroom. Pinochet tried to protect her, and you fell into the fit, 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 fit of alcoholic rage and killed Pinochet! Due to Pippa being drugged into sleep, she had no memory of this. But I can assure you, D -d 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 Ghost Politics is the one who mur murdered the one in a true dog right leader, Pinochet! <laughs> No, I didn't do it. You got it all wrong. It was all Jag. I promise you it was all Jag. I'm being framed. I'm being framed. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, no. Where am I? Where am I? No, 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 no. What the fuck is that? No, 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 no,
Fucking joking with me, man. Shut up! Shut the fuck up! Shut the fuck up! Shut the fuck up! Ah! Damn it, dude! I'm fucking tired and shit, man! Dude, I could have been a fucking bar, man! I could have been watching sports! I could have been fucking being served cold beers by bitches with big tits! Instead, I'm fucking here with you tards, man! Fuck Logan Paul and fucking Jake Paul and Jerk Paul and whoever the fuck else. Fuck them all! Fucking shit, man. Give me a drink. I mean, I'm fucking knocking them down, man. It's not fucking helping, man. I'm knocking them down, man! And Mongong, Radio Graffiti. Hey... You forgot to pull in Phil. All right, Phil Harvey, Radio Graffiti. Hello, Ghost. Hey, can you do me another favor? You're asking a lot. What? Oh, hey, 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 man. Can you pull in Jag? Can you pull in Jag for us? Jag's not calling up. He's not on the law. He's not on the line. Well, I got my boy Mongon here. That's going to beat the fuck out of Jag. All right, next fucking. True capitalist radio wrestling match. Me and Jag fucking in a cage. No holds bar. Let's see who fucking does it. Fuck you, Jag. 333 in the chat, gentlemen. And, three, three, and three, Sam's three. gonna go against you, three, Ghost, three, for that three. fucking title. Get fucking ready, you piece of fucking shit. All right, take these fucking guys off. These guys are fucking... What the fuck? <laughs> Shut up! Fucking hell, dude. And by the way, Jag the Luxray is not on the horn, all right? I mean, he's... Well, you fuckers know. You guys are a fucking bunch of fucking assholes, all right? You guys are just a bunch of fucking pricks. How about Fuck the Targe, Radio Graffiti? It's been a long time there, Ghost. How's it going, dude? Whoa! It's West Coast Capitalist, man! Are you kidding me? West Coast? Are you just a real West Coast? There's not some fucking AI or anything? I am the real West Coast in a motherfucking house, man. I missed you, dude. Hey. I missed you, everybody. Hey, How's dude. it going? Hey, cheers to you. I think everybody there missed you, man. Look at all the fucking people in the chat, man. Look at them. <laughs> hey, dude, cheers to you, man. Uh, right. Thank you for calling on this Baller Friday. Super Beaver Moon. How you been, man? Give it. The floor is yours. What do you got to say, man? Man, I can't believe it's been about a whole lot of a fucking year worth of this goddamn like a shit show has been going on. Especially that my life has been going very well. I graduated from like at a college, man, with a degree. Uh, the Dodgers have won the World Series. And I know that you really dislike the politics pretty much in this year's election, but hey. I'm all for it, man, but I'm 100% like a now politically and financially serious, all thanks to you and the, the, the rest of the capitalists out there, dude, who are always been kicking and chilling like a bad fucking villains. And shut up, you fucking trolls in that goddamn chat room. Nobody's talking here. You're damn all right. Are talking, Look man. at fucking West Coast capitalist, <laughs> man. He's become a capitalist. He's out here, he's become politically aware, and look at all these fucking people in the chat room, dudes. They're molding. Look at them, they're molding, man. You I'm glad to hear it. are just a bunch of fucking pussies, dude. No wonder why that you're always eating a fucking, like, a Kamala Harris's fucking dirty old cooch while you're out of your fucking Kamala Harris sips. Fuck <laughs> Hey, man, it's good to hear from you, man. All right, hold on. Stay on the line. 
All right, stay on the line for a second because I'm going to take other radio graffiti calls, but I'm going to bring you back on here. We got West Coast Capitalist in the house. Uh, let me get to some radio graffiti, and we'll get to we'll get to some more uh, West Coast and what what he's doing and shit. All right, and hold on, Viva Lavon Radio Graffiti, <laughs> Cow Bad Dragon Radio Graffiti. I am so sick and fucking tired of Vaughn. The jam ruined the entire website for me, and now I have to do myself a favor. I'm hitting a plane to Tennessee to take off the Vaughn chat in the stream forever. And I'm not always tired of them, but I'm also tired of Mark for making me have to be dishonest with him on what I smoke. All right. I'm getting my gun. Engineer, look on a place for me. Hey, this is Mark. <laughs> Wait, what? Ghost is trying to take down my wholesome platform? What the fuck? Hey, Mark. Ghost, um, what are you doing here? And why do you have that shotgun? Your fucking chat sucks. I've had it with the Vaughn chat, and now I'm going to make sure I take off the Vaughn chat forever. Not only that, the Vaughn dot live forever. One more thing. Yes, I smoke tetrahydrocannabinol. I like that, Mark. Oh, I like that. Oh, my God. They call him boss. He's a boss. Boss, oh. boss. Well, what's going on in Mark Vaughn's house? I need to see what's happening. Ghost, put that fucking gun down. Oh my god! This is a new low, even for da, you! Da, da, shut up, you cookie monster piece of shit! This doesn't concern you! Yes, it does concern me, Ghost. Seriously, I thought you were better than this somehow. Even if I have really low expectations of you. And I bet you're doing this because what? You hate the VOD chat? Oh my god, man. Alright. Uh... Oh, what goes? A hundred dollars! Oh, shit! Why didn't he see a hundred dollars? Ha! There was no one hundred dollar bill, Ghost. I just freed Mark while I took away your shotgun. Yeah, how do you like that, Ghost? Thanks. Alright, Ghost. Because you attempted my life, I'm banning you off of Vaughn.Live forever. What? Really? You're gonna ban him? I mean, that's kind of what he wants, honestly. What do you mean? He almost tried to kill me. I mean, I do have an idea of what you can do with Ghost. Even, especially after what happened, you see? Now, you're probably wondering, why the fuck am I only doing Vaughn again? Well, that's because I have a contract. An exclusivity contract of Vaughn.Live now. I can't stream my kick anymore. Not DLive, not Rumble, none of them. Just Vaughn.Fucking Live, man. <laughs> I buy that. It also requires me to get the text to speed back. And I had to come on time this time. Only because of this contract. If I don't, this shot dollar will go off unless I start this stream. Ugh, Christ, man. Also, by the way, I'm going to do right here to feed in a couple minutes. But first, I got to get the Twitter shoutouts. I have to finish them. Both radio graffiti calls and Twitter shoutouts now. Regardless if they piss me off. Jesus fucking Christ, man. I hate you fucking trolls. And I can't even take the Vaughn chat off anymore because the, the shot caller will go off and I even try. You fucking cookie monster fuck! What the fuck was that stupid fucking cookie monster shit? What the fuck was that? Viva Lavon, yeah, Viva Lavon, Viva La these nuts! All right, dude, I'm doing another video. Yeah, 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 yeah! I'm doing another fucking video. I don't care if you cocks fucking bitch and moan about it. 